Thanks for tuning in today. Drive by. It's uh, February 16th, 2017, and I'm in uh, heading to Naples, Florida. I'm on the I-75. It's about oh, 82 degrees. 1125 in the morning, and today is Thursday. You know what? I wanted to bring up something. Uh, there today, they're having this. Uh, Washington DC and other parts of the country they're boycotting uh, because of uh, this uh, pending ban on illegal immigrants and Muslims and stuff and a lot of businesses are closing or they're not opening guess what you know what I say if you're that stupid and you got a business and you want to lose money go ahead and uh, why don't uh, all the places that can't run their businesses why don't they start hiring uh, the poor blacks or poor whites there's plenty of black people out there that are citizens of the United States that are looking for jobs. And I would uh, suggest that all you guys in whatever part of the country they have this boycott going on, apply to these businesses. And now you see how many illegal aliens, uh, immigrants, are in these businesses. Because usually that's the way it is. I mean, uh, you know, these people don't go in because these illegal, they're illegal immigrants and they shouldn't be working there anyway. So I'd like to see that and what uh, everybody, what kind of comments you got about what I said. So basically, businesses, if you want to go out of business, fine. If you don't want to hire somebody, fine. If you want to boycott, fine. And there's plenty of room for other businesses to be run by blacks and whites and other Irish and Polish and, you know, people that aren't making a lot of money. Why don't you, why don't they just get the job then and let them go work there? It's ridiculous, you know, and I like to know what everybody else thinks. Thanks.